So today, as promised, I am going to be doing an unboxing slash sew and tell of As If It's Your Last. This is actually kind of an exciting release for me because this was the first official Blackpink release that I got to actually fanboy over and be, uh, you know, kind of be there from the beginning when it was announced and all the teasers. So this particular song is very, very special. So I'm going to take it out of this plastic first so we can actually get some glare out of the way here. So here is the front. This promo is actually um, quite different from Square 1 and Square 2 because they um, only have one track on it, just the Korean version. So um, a little information about the CD itself there. Um, again, it is a promo, so it's not for sale. I ordered the CD on September 5th, 2017, and it was officially released by YG as kind of like an in-house promo, um, June 22nd, 2017. So, um, of course, another song produced by the wonderful, awesome Teddy. Love that man. He does awesome work for our girls. So, this one is not autographed, as you can see. I'm going to take it out of this so we can, again, get a little less glare. Yeah, this one's not autographed, as you can see, which is, again, fine with me. Um, this one, I don't mind telling you how much I paid for it, <laughs> because it's uh, not as bad as the others. But I paid 120 for it, and you have to remember, this was back right around the time it came out. So you can very much find it at a cheaper price now on online or other places. So I wouldn't expect to still see it for that price unless it's autographed and I really haven't researched it so I have no idea if it's considered rare or not but let's do a little open on the inside get this zoom in, focus like the other YG promos they all have the lyrics inside along with credits so let me get that focused We ride a die, X's and O's. I love that line. I think uh, Lisa's rap of this song is my favorite. We got the back. So as you can tell, the cover of the promo is pretty similar to the digital one. I do prefer this one a little bit better just because of the color scheme which is <laughs> so silly. It's not that much different, but I do prefer this one. Um, like I said, though, this was very exciting. It was the first time I was able to kind of follow along with all the teasers, and I just remember just hearing that intro beat. I just knew I was going to love this song. Lisa's English rap blew me away. Um, one funny thing uh, that I was really wrong on, um, and I didn't really realize this until the Japanese version came out, um, the part in the verse, or I guess not the verse, but the part right before the chorus when they say, um, won't you set me free? I always thought in the Korean version they say, so tonight won't you set me free? But when I listen to the Japanese version, they definitely don't say tonight, so <laughs> that's kind of funny. I was was convinced they were saying so tonight won't you set me free you know what i could have done i could have looked in the lyrics and got that clarification without having to be waiting until i heard the japanese version so okay so i think we showed this off enough let's go to the actual disc let's show that off so again we got just the standard black pink logo around the corner so you guys can see the text if I can get it zoomed there we go Stand cool. 
Energy. Okay, so that's the CD itself there. Put that back. Before I put that back, I'll kind of show you the inner tray. Just kind of get that like purple, pink, kind of cloudy effect. Show you the insert there. And then we got the back. Since I didn't really have a very successful time trying to pop out square square two, <laughs> I'm gonna just leave this in the case. So we're just gonna <laughs> do some close-ups. So there's our title. As if it's your last. We got our authenticity stamp we got all the promo information and contacting YG luckily we don't have to send them any more harassing emails and calls because they have finally agreed to come through with square up And there we go, as if it's your last. So, I just yesterday pre-ordered uh, the pink and the black editions of Square Up, so once they come, I will for sure give those a review. But again, thank you for watching. I appreciate all the views and comments, and I'm glad you guys love watching me unbox my black pink stuff. I enjoy buying it, so I don't I don't mind at all sharing it with the world. But uh, thank you very much for watching.